Hi, I'm the Barbecue Butcher. Today I'll be cutting and trimming a Carrara Wagyu rump. This is the rump here. It has a fat side, which you can easily see, and on the other side is the meat side. So there is a difference, but in the first cut we'll be doing is the picanha, which is here, or what is called the rump cap as well. And the first cut you do is this piece of fat here, you just scoop it out with your little knife, put it there. Then the golden rule to butchery is seams. And if you see how I pull that back there, you can see the seams. So you just run your knife down there, push, pull, push, pull, push, pull, push, pull, and it just falls it off. And then you come down there and it'll just stop. It won't be able to push anymore with your knife or your hand. You get your knife straight across. That's the rump cap and we'll come back to that. The next piece is the what we call heart of rump. And this is what we'll be taking our rump steaks out of. Turn it over. And the first cut, always just cut it off and you can use this for stir fry or put into cubes and you can make kebabs. So get, make it nice and straight, down, pull back. And then you can see it's all even and then we can start. So as on the sirloin video I made, we did the two finger rule. So two fingers, mark it first. You can do this with a normal knife at home, even your kitchen knives, but just give them, get the biggest knife you have for cutting rump because it's a big piece. So remember, down, pull back. You can put that down. And there's a big rump stakes. We do it again, two fingers in, down, back. And the object of trying to make one motion is so you don't get any slashes in the meat or tears. And we're gonna take one more off, two fingers again, down, back. And then this last piece here, I use this for a rump roast. You can slow cook it, you can roast it in your oven, but I like putting it on slow cook on my big green egg. You just put it on whole, it's got a nice fat covering that'll keep it all keep it all nice. So put these back there. Got the rump roast. Now this is the rump cap which we took off first. This is one of the most popular cuts on the market at the moment. It's great for slow cooking over charcoals on your big green egg or other slow cook methods. So it has a bit of fat, you cut it off there, and we're going to just tidy it up a bit. And you come down here, and you'll see, take that sheet of fat off, and there's a little bit of gristle, or silver skin. And this is, that's a bit, and then you put your knife under, down. And then you see what I've done, you can grab it, and then again, Slowly pull it off. You can get that one. And again, try not cut into the meat. And the last one, move this around. Always move the meat to suit you. And there we go. And this, this is, I'll show you what the gristle is under there. And you can see it, and it doesn't tear, doesn't rip. And then come down here, trim it all up, trim it what you want off. I like leaving a lot of the fat on because it's really good. Turn it over and look at the other side, perfect. So then you just put salt and oil on that and put it into roast or into slow cook. If you see any other little bits, trim it off. And there you go. That is, uh, that is how to cut and trim a Carrara Wagyu rump into 
rump cap, rump steaks, and a rump roast. Remember to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel.